Skeptics and even Warriors players truly believe James Harden is faking the eye injury he suffered in game two. On top of that, it's still up in the air whether or not he will be able to play in game three. I don't know what to believe here. What's going on, Fumble Fam? It's your boy, Chris, but you can also find me over on my YouTube channel, CK2K, but make sure you subscribe right here, hit that notification bell, and don't forget to like the video. And once again, I'm excited to announce our partnership with ESPN+. Plus. Stay tuned until the end of the video to find out how you can get a free seven-day free trial on ESPN+, Plus, where you can stream all of your favorite live sports anytime you want. Now, James Harden tends to get a bad rap with the way he plays. Now, the Warriors don't trust that he is truly as hurt as he is leading on. Not even five minutes passed before James Harden was hit in the head by Draymond Green, resulting in the bloodshot eye seen around the basketball world. Here's the play to refresh your memory. They'll watch it again. Harden did come back, but to no avail as the Rockets still lost game two and now trail 2-0 in the series. As if that wasn't enough for Harden, now Warriors players are calling James a liar and saying he's not as hurt as he's leading us on to believe. Before I can even continue, look at that man's eye. Dude looks like he got a whole other creature swimming around in there, and the thing looks gross. And you mean to tell me y'all think that that's fake? He may have oversold it, that I can co-sign, but fake? I don't know about that one, Chief. Chris Haynes of Yahoo Sports said this. There are some players in that Warriors locker room that are not buying the whole James Harden eye being extremely hurt thing. They were talking about some of the shots he was shooting during the game, then when he goes to the free throw line, and squinting like he can't see. I get the game plan. Still plan for him as if he was 100%, but then just say that. Don't come out here talking like he's lying. I mean, look at this thing. And then just a day later, he looked like this. As gruesome and gross as that eye looks, still a few days later from the initial injury, some Warriors players are calling BS. Unbelievable. I bet you the same dude that caused that injury is the main dude leading this craziness. I'm not gonna name any names. James Harden claims that after some time to let his eye heal, the pain is much better and so is his vision. This is what Jonathan Fegan said with more detail. Harden said his left eye still hurts, but his vision is better. Not 100%, he will practice today. Immediately after the game though, the doctor diagnosed Harden with a contusion and a cut on the inside of his eyelid. I can't even get through saying that without cringing, bruh. ESPN's Tim McMahon elaborated saying this. James Harden went straight to an eye doctor after Rockets plane landed in Houston this afternoon. Team is optimistic he won't have issues with vision in game three and beyond. His left eye where he has a contusion and cut inside eyelid especially bothered him in game two. So the big question we all want to know the answer to is, will James be playing in game three? Here's your answer. James Harden was asked if he was good to go for game three. I mean, if I played barely seeing last game, what makes you think I'm gonna sit out game three? Hashtag Rockets. I don't know, this is all so damn loony to me that the Warriors think he could be faking this injury. But I know y'all in the comments are really critical of James Harden as well. So let me know what you guys think in the comments. Now, Fumble Fam, we are so excited to become an affiliate with ESPN Plus. ESPN Plus has a huge live sports selection where you can catch all of your favorite MLB, MLS, and NHL teams throughout the season. Fewer ads and more highlights for every crazy sports fan out there. You can also stream a selection of international soccer matches as well as college football, basketball, and tons of others, all watchable on over 10 devices, including iOS, Android, Apple TV, Fire Stick, Roku, and so many others others. The app lets you rewind live games and replay full games on demand anytime you want. ESPN Plus also has some of the dopest original content including Kobe Bryant's detail, OJ's Made in America, ESPN FC, and much much more. You can also get 20 UFC Fight Night exclusives with over 100 plus total fights including main card events and exclusive original content all through the easy to access ESPN Plus platform. Our friends at ESPN Plus are giving Fumble fans a special 7 day free trial with access to some of the coolest content out there. So join today and get a seven day free trial that you can cancel at any time. If you wanna keep watching, you can join thereafter for just $4.99 a month or $49.99 for the whole year. It's been your boy Chris. Catch you guys in the next video, I'm out of here.